Hello, and thanks for checking out ChartGuys.com. We're proud to be one of the most successful technical analysis communities online, teaching you the skills to become a more confident, effective, and informed trader. Join our community of hundreds of analysts worldwide working together to learn the charts, generate profit, and achieve financial independence. Sign up for a one-week free trial, no credit card required, for access to daily live chart analysis and market coverage, a thriving chat community, along with dozens of hours of exclusive educational materials. We look forward to seeing you. Let's check out some charts. Checking it on oil after a big time breakout to end the week. So we've been looking bullish on oil ever since this lower high pattern broke with our higher high. The downtrend resistance broke. This is the weekly time frame. So it has been about six weeks since that bull signal. And we're ending on an extremely positive note with a ton of bull momentum. Look at this weekly chart. The highest price that we've seen in quite some time, 55.21. Last time we were at those levels was back in 2015. So we're looking at two and a half year highs. If we can get a break of 55.21, that will be extremely significant. Still have about 2% to go to get to that level. But again, the bulls have momentum in their favor. And we ended the week on a really strong note. Look at this daily chart. We were pointing out the potential cup and handle pattern in the video I did last weekend. With the left side of the cup, the right side unable to break it. Healthy consolidation in the cup handle. I'm drawing very roughly here, but then we got the breakout. So this is a cup and handle pattern on the daily time frame that ended up playing out perfectly with all the bull momentum favoring the bulls into the end of the week. Look at that four-hour chart. We are very overextended. So we are going to be expecting consolidation tonight, Sunday night, and uh, tomorrow just, just because it needs to be normal, healthy consolidation to see this move sustainable. The hourly time frame extremely overbought. We've got a support at 5361, but really we're just looking for a higher low above 5223. So tons of wiggle room there, but all out bulls in full control and certainly not looking for a bullish entry position until we get consolidation, if not already in. USO on the daily time frame. So here is that bull break and breakout above the upper Bollinger Band. Increase in bull volume. There's the left side of the cup, the consolidation, the right side of the cup, the handle, and then the breakout. So bulls in full control. Anything above 1029 is a higher low. And in terms of resistance, we have to look to the weekly chart. And the next resistance level is going to be up at 1115 and 1126. Bulls in full control of the short-term momentum. This is a really good end of the week for the oil bulls. And we are going to be looking for continuation after this healthy consolidation. So I would not be surprised to start next week off with you know a day or two of a pullback. But again, we have so much wiggle room due to the size of the breakout that we will easily form a higher low on this initial consolidation. So that's what we've got for oil. Very exciting for these oil bulls because we are looking at a move up towards $60, in my opinion, if we do get over $55.21. And I've been, if you've been watching these videos, we've been talking about this for all year, pretty much. I've been looking for the bulls to make it up towards $60. And that was when we were right here in this mid $50 range was really bullish with that fact and ended up delaying by multiple months with this pullback that we went through. But now we're right back to these levels. And here we are again, if we do break 5516, because we did dump significantly back in July of 2015, there's not much resistance until we get to the upper fifties and right around 60 psychological resistance. That's why it's so exciting for the bulls. If they can break this 5521 level, that will be very significant on the longer term trend. And let's let's look at the monthly chart just to see this longer term trend. We can see that we've been in a clear downtrend for quite some time and we are now forming higher lows and that would be a clear higher high that would have us looking up at the $60 range. So I appreciate you watching. Hope you have a good rest of your weekend and we'll see you throughout the week.